Hey everybody, welcome back to Going Ballistic. We have a really interesting video for you guys today. So I was at my neighbor's birthday party for his daughter and his son came out with this really cool Lego figurine head. And of course, as a gun tuber, I was like, can I shoot it? And he said, no. So I thought, well, that's kind of a cool idea. A lot of people have shot Legos and built stuff out of Legos, but I've never seen a video where they actually shot figurines. So I was looking on um, Amazon and I found these awesome tanks here. So we have a T-14 Armada, we have a Panzer, and we have an M1A2 Abrams here. And the rounds we're gonna use, these are 223 pink tip rounds. These things were special made rounds and uh, they make a wonderful fireball. Now I'm hoping the tanks, we can hit them at the right place and it'll actually set the fireball off, so that'll be cool. So on these tanks here, I wanna give a shout out to my neighbor's uh, son, Nehemiah. He built these two tanks, like 2,000 pieces in about five hours. He is a Lego genius. I built this one and it took me about 15 hours. It was crazy build. If you wanna exercise your mind, build one of these bad boys because the bags are not numbered and they are all mixed up in parts and you just have to go buy pictures. So this is what we got for you guys today. I hope the high speed turns out really good on this one. But uh, let's get this rolling, but first a quick word from our sponsor. Hey everybody, this video is brought to you by Guardio. You use protective gear when you're at the range, so why not be safe when you're browsing the internet? Guardio is your protective gear while you're browsing the internet. Look, don't wait for accidents to happen. Identity thieves and con artists are lurking the internet all the time, and you wanna protect yourself and your family before something bad happens. For only 10 bucks a month, you can protect yourself and up to four family members. Browsers play a key role in our everyday lives, storing our most valuable information from messages, banking, crypto, passwords, and our private information. Guardio detects these threats before they reach your browser, unlike traditional solutions that only removed it once it was on your device. So why do I use Guardio? So I don't get scammed. Click the link for a free security scan and protect your identity from cyber attacks. Join over a million customers who are browsing safely online with Guardio. Run a free security scan in a few clicks, remove threats instantly, and get full protection when browsing online. Guardio works 24-7 to block malicious websites, disable harmful pop-ups, and prevent identity fraud. So go to Guardio now. Go to guard.io forward slash going ballistic and click the link to claim your seven day free trial, a free system scan, and 50% off your first month. What are you waiting for? Protect yourself today with Guardio. All right, so first one up is the Abrams, and we have a scaled down howitzer with our 155 millimeter artillery rounds. Pink tip, that is. Now with these rounds, they're a little finicky on accuracy. We were trying to zero with them. We had a huge deviation at even such a close distance. So I'm gonna aim the best I can. Hopefully it stays semi-consistent.
<laughs> oh, that looks so cool. I know. <laughs> that was some really cool high speed. I, I absolutely love that. But the thing is, is we couldn't tell exactly where it hit. Now he was hitting center mass here. And uh, like Justin said, um, these rounds were going just all over the place. So we could not zero them in. However, he did hit the tank because we have a couple pieces here where the bullet definitely went through. Now, where this went through, I don't know. We're gonna have Nehemiah uh, see if he can put these back together. Oh, there it is. It went low. It ripped that right in half, Justin, completely in half. I did it on purpose. Of course. I mean, that's just, you know, you're that good of a shot, bro. So <laughs> that was really cool. I mean, <laughs> I'm glad we did this. This was a cool idea. So Justin uh, suggested, what if we take some shots, you know, with the nine mil or something to make it look like mortar fire and then hit it. So that was great. All right, that was awesome. I absolutely love that. I can't wait to get on. Now we'll get on to the T14. So here we go. All right, so now it's time for the T14 battle tank versus Z155 howitzer. Yeah, the hard part is deciding where to aim because sometimes they'll go high, sometimes they'll go low, left, right. Who knows? So let's aim center ish. Well, here it goes. Oh, wow. That, that was raining pieces for a while. Oh my God, we're never gonna find those. That's gonna be a long cleanup. <laughs> Considering that we want to be able to put these back together. Um, I don't think that was a 155 that hit this tank, Justin. I think it was a 500 pound bomb <laughs> and dropped right on it. That, that one was just picture perfect. It destroyed this entire tank this is incredible we're going to be picking up pieces uh hopefully nehemiah can put these back together uh, as you guys saw in the video this was actually i think spun around if i remember on the high speed um he hit center mass and it just destroyed that thing i seen this the helmet <laughs> come off the guy there <laughs> that's where it went yeah but um, there's the one guy, he fell in the hole, he's safe. The other ones, I have no idea, man. They're, these pieces are everywhere, bro. Oh. <laughs> um, this is kind of graphic, but I found a weapon and he's still holding on to it. Oh, no, gross. Oh, that is disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> right from his cold, dead hand. <laughs> Oh my gosh, blew the whole barrel off. Here's the barrel. Oh, that was awesome. I hope you guys are enjoying this video as much as we are. This is this has got to be one of the funnest videos Justin and I have got to make because let me tell you, this has been a nightmare putting this last tank together. Here's some quick pictures of how it goes together. Um, this one is very detailed inside. You have to build the motor and everything else. And I'm old, so that's why it took about 15 hours versus Nehemiah, who made both of these in like six, five hours. So, oh, here's, here's a guy. Yeah, he's good. He's still shooting. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> it's just.
just a flesh wound. Okay, well, we're going to pick this up and get on to the Panzer. So here we go. Let us know in the comments what you thought about that last one. It looked more like someone dropped a JDAM on that thing. If you haven't seen the carnage of a JDAM, you got to look it up. It's absolutely insane. So now it's time for the Panzer. I'm going to hold the same way. I'm going to see if I can take this guy's hat off as well at the same time. Go for it. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. We got another big cleanup to do. That was beautiful though. That was definitely a, I think that was a Moab that dropped on that one. That thing is <laughs> just destroyed like the other one. That was phenomenal. There were pieces everywhere, man. The last one took us a while to pick up. This one, definitely the same thing. Oh, this was part of, I think, a fuel tank or radiator. It was in the back. Here's the engine. This was a really cool build. Again, if you want to stimulate your brain, build one of these things because you had to build so much stuff. There were two guys sitting in here. There are not two guys sitting in here anymore. Let's see, I'm trying not to step on any of this stuff and bury it because uh, we want Nehemiah to check this one out. Well, that hit right above this guy, but look at that, not even a scratch. I wonder if we could find any of the guys. Oh, more graphic stuff. Mm -hmm. There's the seats. There's no bodies, but there's an arm. Oh. Disgusting. Oh, there's, an there's an arm. What's under the wood there? Uh oh, let's there. let's see. Corpses. Get some. Oh, I got legs. You got some legs? Oh, we got some legs here. Sorry, people. I know this is extremely graphic. Hopefully, no one gets triggered. Yeah. <laughs> all right, bring out the CBs to undig all this stuff. And... Uh, maybe. Lots of debris, Debris. Oh, another set of legs. Don't look, don't look. Turn away, children. Turn away. Oh, and a head. Gross. Look at that. Looks like he took some impact right <laughs> there on the head. He sure did. He might have set the other part of the round off there. <laughs> wow. Oh, my gosh. This was such a fun video to make. <laughs> Again, sorry for the graphic content, you know, the arms and heads and legs and worst the engine i mean just sad look at that she held up i i can't believe this thing didn't come apart when i was putting this thing together this stupid thing kept popping out and then it stays on an explosion <laughs> very cool pieces way up here we got pieces over the back side we probably have pieces about well scale wise about a quarter mile away we're going to be looking for these well, thanks a lot for sitting here and watching this video with us. We had a good time and we really appreciate you guys. Thank you to our patrons for your continued support. 
we got eight patrons and they are sticking with us and we thank you guys so much for that um man just thank you guys so much we'll be back <laughs>